housing the homeless population. One group is working on a solution to turn a former motel into a new housing model. To news reporter Amy Cockrum is working for you to break down how it works. These rooms are soon to become housing for approximately 30 people experiencing homelessness in Roanoke. The old Apple Valley Motel about to be full of life again. Don Sandoval is the founder of the Least of These Ministry. This community has supported us generously over the years and we're trusting that they're going to do that this time as well. The newest challenge she's taking on providing housing to people experiencing homelessness. People who are on a fixed income or have jobs that just don't pay them enough to afford housing on their own. Tenants will pay based on their income and private donations will cover the rest. People can stay for a day, a week, or however long they need to. It doesn't take a lot to look around and figure out that there's a lot of housing shortages, shelter shortage, um, affordability issues. According to Blue Ridge Continuum of Care's last estimate, there are about 330 people experiencing homelessness in the Roanoke region. Neighbor Mike Montgomery says he was originally worried to learn who may be moving next door, but he's feeling optimistic now after speaking with Sandoval. She's not going to put up with any drugs and violence or any kind of bad behavior is, is what she's reassured me and, and so yeah I feel better about it. We are trying to take something that has been dormant and unused and revitalize it and use it for a purpose that's going to positively impact the lives of many people. They plan to launch the new housing by January 2024 in Roanoke. Amy Cockrum, 10 News, working for you.